this first poem is kind of my introduction, kind of to introduce you to who I am and what I'm about. So what happens when a phoenix loses fire? I'm asking you, what does a hopeless dreamer do when you lose all desire, when that dancer's feet can't keep up with his heartbeat, when an artist is being enslaved by the next masterpiece? What does a singer do when their soul is off key? This poem is for 25 hour days. This poem is for eight day weeks when time does not fly. It moves a bit slower when it's hard to get by, but we've all been there. When your practice just don't add up to the outcome. All that time you put in don't coincide with your income when a writer is just tired. They say we're living in days when we are easily angered but slowly inspired when passions flame flickers. I ask you to remember, can you try and remember why it is you do the things you do? Like what is the reason you make your sacrifice? I know on my darkest nights I had the right to reignite because sometimes life will take its toll. But there's no debit or credit to this. I write this life a Nike check and I just do it. So let's really get into it. About the times I have to uplift me when I need uplifting. I write these lines when I'm out of a line. I wish I could tell you every line I said I meant. But sometimes I have to admit I write how it should be rather than how it is. I'm trying to speak a new me into being because sometimes you got to talk confidence into yourself. Then I find myself asking myself, am I by myself? I often wonder, is the rest of this world just as messed up as me? I wonder. Are we all unfinished puzzles pretending we found our missing pieces? I wonder, are we all just a bunch of broken glass in beautiful garbage bags? I wonder, are we pointing fingers at each other to divert attention from ourselves? I think we may be afraid of ourselves, so you can ask me how I'm doing. I'm chilling, how about you? That really means I got a bag full of problems in my back pocket, but I know you do too. Some mother and father issues, some career and passion conflicts. Man, I've been in some relationship wrecks, but I bet you have too. I get to step up here and get a little bit of it out of me. I smoke quotes from my own notebook in hopes of being a higher me. Not perfect by a long shot. I made my mistakes. I had to pay the fee, but hopefully my father has forgiven me for days. I contemplated death for no reason. I already have regrets about decisions I haven't even made yet for days. I shoved my insecurities inside of her and called it meaningless sex. There were days where I lied because the truth was something I didn't think you had the time. I didn't think you had the attention span to hear, but I'm still here. Remembering that hollow me, aspiring to reclaim the same fire that inspired me. Because some days you gotta forget their hate, you gotta forget their gossiping, you better love yourself without apology. They call me bird, undoubtedly, but with these words of Phoenix, I gotta be. So if you never knew, well, now you know. A while ago, I too lost control. That same emptiness helped make me whole. All flowers have weathered the same storm before, because when you're that deep in dirt, you have no choice but to grow. I found me though. So tell the dreamer, forget your situation. You take back your inspiration. You better walk like you never lost it. Forget exhaustion. I don't care if you have to snatch your dream out of the throat of a nightmare. You tell the singer, you better sing. And when you do, you sing like your next note is so powerful, it can make a demon flatline. Tell the dancer to dance. You better move like your heart beats the baseline. And for my writers, when writer's block has you boxed in, you punch line, you box back. And if you are none of that, if you are none of the above, you remember why you love, why do you do the things you do? Forget the BS, your passion is like Red Bull. It's your wings, take flight, use my words like gasoline. Our heart's the spark. Let's reignite. Yeah.